Hey everyone, so serendipity at work here. If you missed it, I did a come shopping with me video very recently. In fact, was it a week ago? It may have been. And I walked you through a few places, but one of them was my Walmart cart. And right after that video, I actually hit buy on quite a few things, took some things out, added some things, whatever. And then either later that day or the very next morning, I got an email asking if I'd be interested in doing a Walmart video on spring fashion. And I said, well, I'm ready to do one because I'm waiting on an order to come in. So here I am at wearing something that should look familiar because it was in that video. And I have a few more things to show you. So this is in fact a sponsored video from Walmart. And we're gonna talk about some pieces I picked up walking into spring fashion because it's finally warming up. I'm really excited. And then at the very end, one totally random thing that you'll also recognize from that video that has nothing to do with spring fashion. So this first piece was not in that video. I really, really love the EV1 Alex Relax jeans. I already have two pairs. I have the, I think it's the medium wash and then the light wash. And I really wanted a pair in white. And so when I saw that they brought out a white shade for spring, I jumped on it. And I've always had this issue with white jeans. I find that they look amazing on everybody, but I personally am never very comfortable in them. I buy them in my true size in other pairs of jeans that I like, and I always find them to run too small on me, even though I have the exact same pair in another wash and they're fine. These fit perfectly, just like the other shades that I have them in. And I love the distressing on these. I'm, I'm actually sitting and wearing them right now. Even though they're distressed, there's no holes in them. I like the distressed stripes on the side. I like everything about these. They're not heavy. They're perfect for spring. I can easily wear this into these into summer. I just adore them. I love the EV1 Alex Relax jeans. If you haven't tried them out, they definitely run true to size. Dare I say even a little on the large side. So for white jeans, I'd say buy your true size. For the other jeans, the ones I have now are actually a little too big on me. You might either get your true size or even try sizing down one, but I love them. Okay, now let's talk about the top. You probably remember from the Come Shopping With Me video, I was looking at a different graphic tee, a similar message, but then I saw this one also, probably when I was going through the EV1 line. Um, and I love, I have another EV1 shirt that's her love shirt that they brought back for this season. I'll link it in the description box. I love the fabric of the EV1 t-shirts. They are super, super soft. I have felt nothing quite like them in a t-shirt. And when I saw this graphic tee, I liked it just a little bit better. So I grabbed it. So this kind is cool, which you can see. I like the colors. I like just how it goes down the, the full body of the shirt. It is. Uh, very lightweight, I wouldn't say see-through, but you definitely need a nude color bra. You're gonna see the line of my jeans there. So um, I think it's a great weight as we move into the hotter months, so that's fabulous. And if you wanna layer that's for right now, that's great too. You're not gonna get too warm wearing it, but I think it's wonderful. There's other uh, graphic tees, if this is something you like, there's a ton of them from EV1, and Time and True also came out with a bunch for spring as well. And as you know, if you find something you like at Walmart, snatch it up because everybody else likes it too and they do sell out pretty quickly. I love utility jackets. I feel like they just add a certain element to any wardrobe and I already have a lot, I have a lot. But then I found these and I they fit a niche that I didn't, you'll see. Okay, so the first one is this pink one. So first of all, I didn't have a pink one and if pink is not your thing, it comes in other colors, I just, I like the way it was shaped. I like the pink color, obviously. I like that you can cinch it. It is a cinched utility jacket, I believe is what it is called, so that it's almost like a peplum shape to it. And I like the wide cinched part of it, almost like a ribbon effect that falls down the body. It's just a, an interesting silhouette and I think it's a lot of fun. You could tie it in a variety of ways if that's not a look that you like, but I absolutely love it. Now the actual material is super soft. It almost feels like you're wearing a shirt jacket. That's how soft it is. It does, it's not stiff like some utility jackets are. So I absolutely love this and I've been wearing it nonstop. I actually, I just pulled it out of my closet. I just could not wait to wear it. And it's what you see in the thumbnail. Now let's talk about the next jacket. This one I love so much, I bought two of them. And it's an anorak utility jacket. I'm not really sure what defines it as an anorak. 
I don't really care. I just saw this on the website and I had to have it. I love this shape. I like, it's sort of a safari style, which is a really big trend for spring this year. I love the longer length. I really like that it is a longer length. It's a mid thigh. I love that it has pockets that you can slide your hands into on the sides, but that they also, it has the flat pockets. But what I really, really like, even though I do like the pink utility jacket I just showed you, I like the inside toggle cinch. So everything is sort of neat and tucked in. I like that this is a true functioning jacket. It's not as soft, it's not like a shirt jacket. The other jacket I showed you is more of a, a decorative piece, if you will. This is a functional jacket. It has a full zipper and it has snaps. It has snaps on the cuffs. You obviously can unsnap them. I like to wear it rolled up when it's more of a part of my you know, outfit, so to speak. But this is a great jacket. You could have the collar sort of popped or you can you know, have it rolled down. I have it right here to show you. I mean, this is a great piece. It's a nice, heavier uh, cotton. And you can see it has the zipper and it makes for a nice silhouette so you can cinch it in at the waist so it's not just this big, heavy, bulky piece on you. It has that toggle right there so you can get that cinch just how you like it and it's inside the jacket. It's just a great piece. Obviously, everyone needs it in this olive green shade. That is the staple color. But of course, I couldn't just stop there when I saw they had it in gray. I picked it up in gray, a great neutral piece. They also have it in a really nice tan that would go with just about everything. That is a really great color to get for the safari trend. If you're you know, trying to bring in the spring trends for 2020, absolutely recommend it. The pricing on these, unbelievable. All the sizing and pricing should be going across the screen. It's also listed in the description box. So I am just so super pleased with these jackets you are probably gonna get sick of seeing them because I will be wearing them easily for years to come. Now let's talk a little bit about some accessories because I also went a little crazy. Well, I wouldn't say crazy. I bought two things. I bought two handbags. The first is what you're seeing on the screen and I grabbed it here. We also talked about this in the Come Shopping With Me video. It is a very large tote bag. So large, in fact, that it takes up the whole screen. Um, so we're just gonna set it down so you can see it. Uh, in the cutaway over there, or is it over there? But anyway, just in case you can't tell from the B-roll that's going on next to me, it does have exterior pockets on both sides, really deep pockets on the front, well, on this side, also there's tassels, and on this side, and then inside, it's hard to tell because it's navy blue, it's not black and white, it's a navy blue in sort of a ivory shade, it has a magnetic, no, well, it's definitely a snap. I can't tell you if it's magnetic or not, but it is a snap and really deep. I could probably fit one of my Westies in here. Two interior slip pockets. There is a zipper pocket here if you want to secure something more securely. And big rope. Really soft, like nice. Like they're, they're not going to rub you if you're wearing sleeveless. Like they're soft rope. Uh, handles. And if this print is not your thing, I think there are four or five other options that you can choose from. And then, um, ah, this top, let's cut away to that for a moment, shall we? So I did talk about this top in the Come Shopping With Me video. This peplum kind of uh, cinched waist top. It's just fun. It's a fun, pretty spring color. Obviously it comes in some solid pastel shades. There are some prints and florals as well. This is one of my favorite colors. I just love it. Um, the elastic here on the arms is not tight, although it does give you some options. I do not have skinny arms, so it still has room. It's not gonna leave marks on my arms. It has a little bit of a puff sleeve, but not overly, you know, not too fashion forward, I think, so it's, it's very wearable. I think it's easy to get a cardigan or blazer over this if you wanna wear this to work or something like that. It has decorative little buttons. They don't do anything. And it's just, it's really an easy machine washable, which is key. And uh, obviously I'm paired it with these white jeans for the video. You can wear it with any kind of jeans, pants, over a pencil skirt, a midi skirt, very versatile piece to have in your spring wardrobe. And then the other handbag I wanted to show you is this guy, also from the video, I believe that we talked about on Sunday. 
It's a trend that was here last year, maybe even the year before, the clear kind of top handle bag. This bag is really fun because I love the blush. I think blush, it's a neutral. It goes with pretty much everything. I love the little polka dots, also a trend for this year. This bag is a multi-purpose because you can wear it in so many ways. The strap comes off, let's just take it off. And I should say that this strap is fully adjustable. So you can make the bag a shoulder bag or you can make it into a crossbody bag for just about any length and height of person you are. Then you have this bag and if you don't want to have the pouch for some reason or maybe you're taking it to a stadium or some kind of event where you need a fully clear bag, no problem. This guy comes out and now you have just this and it's sturdy, it will stand up all by itself. It's magic. Inside this, it's just an open pouch. This is how I plan to carry it. I think it's, it's fun, it's beautiful. I really like it. And like I said, it does come in other patterns and there's like a faux croc in a couple of shades as well, so really cute. There's one pair of shoes I picked up. It really doesn't go with the white jeans uh, because they are off-white. So you know it's been a bestseller for a few weeks in a row. It was the Time and True Snakeskin Booty. And then I saw they came out with these. These are the same exact booty. They are ivory instead of snakeskin, except they do still have a little snakeskin on the back. How cute are they? Same super comfortable feel to them, same zipper in and out and the little notch on the outside there, same rubber sole. I love these. They're fantastic. I never imagined I would be wearing ivory or white booties, but I have to tell you, they're fun and they go with everything. I personally have been wearing them with my skinny jeans, like nonstop, and I love them. Okay, and then the last thing I thought had nothing to do with spring, but it, for me it kind of does, and that's because I still had my fall and winter seasonal decorative pillows on my family room couch, and it was time to swap them. It was past time to swap them out, and I saw on the Walmart website they had these um, more like uh, what are these oblong pillows from Better Homes and Gardens in a variety of colors and this is the exact shade of blue I've been looking for. I love a velvet pillow. I think those are year-round kind of thing and there is another shade of blue or maybe two, two other blue options if blue's your thing. I may pick up two more because there's at least two other spots I could use these in my house if not more. I see more ordering in my future. I love this. It's really squishy. I don't know if you can hear that or it's, they're so comfortable and they're so inexpensive and they look like they're super expensive and I'm happy to report that none of my dogs have noticed the tassels and so that's that's a win because I was a little concerned but just right out of the box they're just beautiful and fluffy and squishy and they feel very expensive and I love them so that is my part one of my Walmart haul because there will be a part two. It's not gonna be a video, but the second half of March, I'm going to be doing a blog post with even more stuff that I found. So if you're interested in seeing a couple of really cute spring dresses that I found on their website and a couple more accessories that I picked to go with them, make sure you're subscribed to my blog, missgoldgirl.com, pretty easy to remember. And there will be some Instagram posts and a couple of exclusive like to know it posts um, of the dresses as well. So if you're not following me in either of those places, all those links will be down in the description box if you're curious. Other than that, that's everything. I am cold, so I'm gonna go put my jacket on and call it a day. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Thank you to Walmart for sponsoring this video. It's always a blast. So many good things online at Walmart, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.